good evening and thanks for joining us on the news at 8. Today, the 11th day in the month of March 2022, I am Adisha last summer, Emmanuel, first the headlines. Group caution Ukwalangwa against attack on Senator Tilda Oji for saying power should shift to Abia North in 2023. Governor David Umayi insists Bonis still APC Critical Committee Chairman as he vows to deal with PDP members. Only PDP can rescue Nigeria, says Governor Godwin Obaseki. These are the headlines. We'll be right back with the details and more after the commercial. Stay connected. APN is at it again. It's time for the reversible and political leadership project evidence in Nigeria. Get ready for the most detailed online TV and radio program tagged Operation Show Your Project. Operation Show Your Project. Showing every Thursday 11 a.m. on ABN TV and radio. Operation Show Your Project is the authentic platform for all elected and appointed leaders in politics at all levels to showcase their accomplishments within the period in office. For project documentation and production, contact us today on 0816-634-7017 or 0816-634-7017. Operation Show Your Project comes up every Thursday at 11 a.m. on ABN TV and radio. Be part of the testimony. Welcome back. Now on the details. Stakeholders from Abian North have described as needless and misguided attacks on Senator Tudor Oji over his declaration of support for power to shift to the zone come to entry three, saying that the former governor deserves commendation and not condemnation. Businessmen and women in Aba Commercial Center of Abia State have been urged to render their support in ensuring the efficient power delivery. This call was made by Chief Executive Officer CEO of Geometric Power Limited, Professor Bart Nanji during an interactive session with key stakeholders in the business community. Eboin State Governor David Umayi has insisted that the Governor of UB State, Mr. May Mala Buni, remains the caretaker committee chairman of the All Progressive Congress. He said this in a backlinky while also vowing to deal with members of the opposition, the People's Democratic Party in the state. The Nigerian Patriotic Quest, MPQ, has said its members are committed to calling on Central Bank of Nigeria Governor Godwin Emefele to contest the 2023 presidential election and that no amount of intimidation will deter them. Over 30,000 insurgents and their families have so far surrendered in the ongoing fight against terrorism in the Northeast Secretary to the Government of the Federation, SGF, Bos Mustafa in Kaduna said. Edo State Governor Mr. Godwin Obaseki yesterday led leaders and members of the People's Democratic Party in Edo State to receive the national chairman of the PDP, Senator Dr. Inyocha Ayu, noting that only the PDP can rescue Nigeria from its current economic woes. The All Progressive Congress Integrity Group has accused Governor Nasru El Rufai of Cardinal State of allegedly misleading party faithful and laying false claims against the chairman, caretaker, extraordinary convention planning committee governor, May Mala Buni. The chairman of Nigerian Governors Forum and AKT State Governor Dr. Kayo Defiemi on Thursday declared that the state gives more funding to the police than the federal government. Fiemi said this while commenting on security votes at a panel discussion organized by the Nigerian Governors Forum, NGF in partnership with the Central for Democracy and Development, CDD. Lagos State Government has announced the suspension on, uh, on the activities of the National Union of Road Transport Workers Union, NURTW, from road motor parks with immediate effect following the interactable crisis that has rocked in the recent times. On foreign scene, Russian President Vladimir Putin on, th on Thursday that Western penalties against Moscow for its military incursion in Ukraine would destabilize the global energy and food market and vowed the country would emerge stronger from the crisis. Putin's special military operation in Ukraine that began on February 24th has triggered unprecedented Western sanctions and sparkled an exodus of international cooperation from Russia. This brings us to the end of the news at 8. But before we go, a recap of our major headlines. 
proved cautions in Kuala against attack on Senator Theodore Oji for saying power should shift to Abia North in 2023. Governor David Umayi insists Buni still APC caretaker committee chairman as he vowed to deal with the PDP members. Only PDP can rescue Nigeria, says Governor Godwin Obaseki. For these and many more, you can log on to our website at www.abntv.com.ng or visit any of the social media platforms displayed on your screen. I am Adesha Lassamo Imano. Good evening.